Deirdre from Mobility Genie. At Mobility Genie, we are often asked for suction grab rails. In general, if it's a long-term situation, an occupational therapist will recommend a fitted fixture. But for a situation, for example, you're going to somebody's house where you know they don't have a grab rail, then these are ideal. The Easy Bar Suction Grab Rail comes in two different sizes. You have the longer length and the shorter length. So just to demonstrate, it comes with a safety lock indicator that displays green when it's secure and red when it's not secured. These are designed only for use on smooth, non-porous surfaces such as tiles, glass, etc. Some tiles might be a little bit ridgy. I'd be careful and test it well. Again, I wouldn't put it where the grout is on the tiles because I don't think you'd get enough adhesion. So you can see when I turn it this way, the two pads that you attach onto the tiles are the glass and then you press down your locks. So there you have a sturdy and safe support without any screws. But you need to follow the instructions extremely carefully. And now we're going to demonstrate in the bathroom. In my mind, a suction grab rail is ideal for a temporary solution, provided the instructions are followed extremely carefully. Say, for example, if you're going on holidays and you're not sure whether they have a grab rail, or if you're going to a friend's house, again, where they may not have a grab rail. They come in two different sizes, so they can be used like any other grab rail, either vertically, at an angle, or horizontally. So vertically, I'm putting it in the correct position over a flat tile. These have to be put on a flat surface. I'll explain why in a moment. So placing it on the flat tile, you can see the red mark here. I'm pushing it until it goes green and then you lock it in. The same with the bottom one. I'm pushing it until it goes green and I'm locking it. So that's in a perfect position now. And it's quite safe. Again, as I say, as long as you follow the instructions extremely carefully. Now, to use it incorrectly, if I placed that over the grouted joint, it's not a flat surface. It's not a flat surface, so you'll see it won't grip. I'll try that again. I'm pressing it in. It goes green, but when I lock it, it won't grip. So it always has to be on a flat surface. Now this is a bumpy tile, quite nice, but bumpy. So again, when I press it on a bumpy tile until it goes green, I'm locking it in, but it won't lock. So you have to have it on a flat surface. And I'll just give you an example in the shower here. You can see that there are both types of tiles. You have the plain tile and you have the bumpy tile. Under no circumstances, use it on the bumpy tile. And where you're using the flat tile, use it away from the grout. So that's your suction grab rail.